These are the Hegemons. That's a new mechanic with the great powers. Uh, you have to be a great power to own any of these, but uh, that's heavy ships. That's not even close. Um, not a million army monthly income of a thousand. That economic hegemon, I think, is going to be the most used. I think that's going to be the easiest to get to. A thousand income. I mean, obviously not right the second, but. Are you guys really not that concerned about your capital? I mean, I, w I feel like you should be very concerned. Our ports are blockaded. Oh, let's uh, hit his boats then. Shouldn't have anywhere to go with your boats, should you? Oh, that pulled him off the capital. That's a battle. I would like to retreat from said battle. Uh, well, we'll stay until that guy enforces. Which apparently was a terrible decision. Alright, we're gonna retreat to here. Great advisor has died, no. That's oh, just the economic one. Uh, I'll take production efficiency. Uh, gives us some money, but not quite what we're looking for here. This is taking our way, that's good. Have a siege. Okay, you do. That's good. Don't you tell, pull off that fort. You bring that fort down. Do all you can. Alright, we can put a leader back in charge here. I did get that tech, right? Yeah, that tech four. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and Recruited general. That's a much better general. I'm willing to fight more battles with this general. He is not willing to fight me, apparently. Well, Bohemia is going to siege the stuff back from me. Forward to glory. Another 10% uh, morale. Great for when we're fighting these wars. We're gonna have to fight Milan next anyways. Milan has claims, so we can fight more princes down that way. Minus 120, nice 19. Yeah, we should get more war score to get things going our way. You're occupying that. Right, let's, let's head back to our capital to protect our capital. Come on, Florence. Get that. It's only in farmlands. Not a great spot to attack, but I have the better general now. Savoy. You have taken land that doesn't belong to you. You'll give up any of it, but all of it would go to Switzerland, and I don't care about Switzerland not having a land, I just want them to exist, so leave it alone. 41%, uh, that's getting there. Um, we can get another battle win here. And... Uh, we can, good, all right, let's... And then we will... I want to make sure that he get this fort here. Took a loan, that's to be expected. But hey, we got enough here. 
We've got the restoration CB. We even have a little bit of money, maybe? Yes, a little bit of money. Cool deal. All right, send demand. And boom, we have Croatia and Hungary in a war. Uh, and Moldavia is a march of Hungary. So really, we have all of that. That is fantastic. Uh, the decline of Hungary. Boom. Done. Uh, and that completes this mission. Uh, Royal Hungary. So now the Hungarian question. So that will be for when we integrate Hungary. And we'll get those accepted cultures. This is secure Croatia. We have to directly own those, it looks like. Okay. Interesting. We have some liberty desire. Of course, it is in Hungary. Um, so I will get someone going to improve relations with them. That is also over our relationship limit. That happens. Uh, offer alliance with Pope. So now Pope is not on this list. Cool deal. Um, let's get our troops back over here to where they need to be so we can get ready to fight Milan with all of our devastating strength we now have uh, once they have been uh, reined in. We got a lot of uh, raise war taxes. Cost two per month while at war. Instead of just the 50 one time. Interesting. So, how does that work with the free war taxes? Okay, it's just a little different. Well, we can pass the second reform. It gets a diplomat and a diplomatic reputation. Good deal. We'll move on to the next spot. Here. Cool deal. Okay. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to take a quick break right here. I think that's a good spot after that war. I'm going to run a commercial and it'll be right back. Uh, let me get. Find. Oh. So you guys do not go anywhere.
Okay, we are back from our break. We just finished our war with Hungary. We forced them into a personal union. Hey, PBK TV, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. We just got back from our little break that we had to uh, refresh a little bit. Uh, we've uh, finished our war with Hungary, forced them into a personal union, which means we also have a personal union with Croatia. How are you liking it so far? Uh, let's see. I, I'm, I'm noticing the governing capacity changes. I know that that's been a big deal with you know, people complain about the states and territories. Uh, so that's interesting. I, I did like the take all the money in one war. I'm trying to work through this uh, mission tree here. That seems interesting. I mean, I can't give any, you know, definite opinions like, yes, buy this, don't buy this, um, until uh, later on, closer to release. But uh, just showing things off, letting people make their own opinions. Uh, I can see other people's mission trees that are under me. That's cool. Um, so I can get them to complete their own missions so that they have, like, claims and stuff. Okay. Neato, neato. I heard you get 10 Imperial Authority for getting a new prince. Uh, I haven't noticed that. I mean, we do have two reforms passed, and it's only 1458. That seems fast to me, although there is a, a large number of princes, and then, of course, the more free cities now. So I'm not sure. Um, we are gearing up to go to war with uh, Milan because I did get a event to um, put this personal union CB on them. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. We got five people now. Uh, can I get rid of the platinum? I'm still married to the platinum. I cannot get rid of them. Mind forcing Milan to release perm for the science. Um. Well, I don't want to do any in um, in Italy because we're trying to uh, Parma. Uh, we're trying to uh, reign in Italy, and so we've got to defeat all these guys in wars and stuff. So I don't want to make any more princes in Italy for us to reign in. Um, next time that there is an unlawful territory, because we have had some unlawful territories trigger where um, we've released a prince back. Um, so it might be easier just to go back and check the VOD. Uh, Dalmatia um, is a member of the HRE. Um, we asked Herzenogervinia to give this back. It wasn't theirs. And so they released Dalmatia, and that became a prince. I don't know if our imperial authority went up by 10 at that point. Albania is also one. Uh, we've got the papal state as an elector right now. So it's a weird situation here in the HRE already. All right, let's give everybody a little bit to uh, recoup. I might uh, ignore Venice and their mission. So we know we've got all kinds of missions. Or I might ignore our agenda here. The state system, that's way different here. We've got all these different things that we're running. Are there any new Catholic bunions you see so far, or only when you're the Pope? Uh, ooh, we've become a great power. Look at that. Uh, I think there's another thing where we have to be a great power, rival a great power, and we have to ally. So we need to ally a great power to continue this onwards. But then we have to be present on five continents. So that's going to take a minute. And that'll give us 20% annexation. Uh, all right, so new... Papal buttons. I I think that's only when you're the Curia controller. I don't notice any. Yeah, I did notice the golden bulls is new. So someone, I guess the Pope. He's then the only Curia controller so far. He passed this. So development cost is minus five percent. And tolerance of heathens is up two. They last until the current Pope dies. Gold bulls are bonuses the papal controller can enact using Curia coffers that benefits all Catholic countries. Yeah. So that this is a new bulls system, uh, but we are not the Curia controller, so I can't do anything about it right now. Uh, OK, 
Okay, still going to get hungry reigned in here. We're going to put these guys on siege. Still losing a ton of money. Army maintenance is very high. The diet of the Hungarian and Croatian nobility. The Croatian and Hungarian nobility have come together in a promptu diet, during which it was agreed upon that the two kingdoms have been governed together under a personal union for decades should henceforth be considered as one, so they can be present a united front towards their Austrian overlords. King of Croatia has therefore been annexed by that of Hungary. Okay. Well then, that's that's good actually. That saves us a relationship slot. I actually like that a lot. That is fine. Um, if I improve relations with him more, then I could break this one. And that's still one, two, three, four. So I'm going to do that. Because um, he can't get married anyway, so I can easily get rid of him. Uh, dissolve alliance. Alright, cool. So now he is even more mad. No, he's still 56. We're improving every day with, or we were supposed to be improving with him every day. Uh, let's improve relations with him. Can I beat them all in a war? So the Shadow Kingdom is different now? Uh, yeah, so the Shadow Kingdom is different now. Uh, you can either rein them in diplomatically, which th what I've found that to mean is you have them as an ally, or you beat them in a war. Those are your two options. And um, so uh, currently we have reigned in Florence and the Papal State because we're allied to both of them. So the rest of those people on the list we have to either ally or beat in a war. We don't really have any more alliance slots left at this point. So I'm just trying to beat them all up, uh, starting with Milan since we have the CB on them. And then they should dis disappear off of this list. I haven't actually attacked anyone to get them off the list yet, so I don't know if that's true. Is there some kind of peace deal you have to take or just win? That's what we're about to find out uh, when I attack Milan here. Uh, once we've uh, recovered a little bit. Why is our army maintenance so high? Is it just for the recovery? If it's just the recovery, then that's not a big deal. Um, this says our army maintenance reinforcement yeah it's just f full of reinforcement right now um supply limits only 12 there i'm gonna make a can i stop you okay i guess we'll find out i'm interested in the new blockade mechanic too um but doubt we're gonna see that for a bit yeah austria not a big naval power so not a whole lot of blockading we're gonna see unfortunately uh, let's go up here We'll go there. And then we'll split some troops. And rearrange. <laughs> He's up early! Yeah, embargo's over on it. Uh, Emperor, gotta show it off, man. Gotta be there right out the gate. What is going on, Abraxas? Hey, let's get this national idea going. Really hope they make blockades more relevant. Navy would feel more worthwhile. I hear you. Uh, we were going to take influence ideas. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Thank you for the follow, PVKTV. Welcome to the league. Glad you could join us here this early, early morning. Uh, we're we're going to take influence ideas because the Liberty Desire, we're going to have lots of personal unions. Uh, it's going to be cheaper to annex all the personal unions. Uh, it's going to have another relationship slot. It's just, just good. I like it. We're going to take influence. <laughs> Robbed your emote. Oh, yeah. Michael Sarah. Apparently, I uh, look like him, so they decided that should be the emote. That's, uh, that's what it is. Uh, all right, let me put in here that uh, we have got... That is our idea. Try to keep my commands up to date. So I don't have to come back here all the time. Current ideas are... Influence. Thank you, Nightbot. Alright. 